maximize three week in calf rates, submission rates and conception rates must be high. However, cows that are not cycling and not showing heat, and also poor levels of heat detection on farms, are major limitations to high submission rates. Also, cows with a uterine disease before breeding are going to have poorer conception rates. So our approach to maximizing the three week in calf rate is to begin by body condition scoring the entire herd to identify thin cows with a body condition score of 2.5 or less. And these cows need to be put on once a day milking until at least three weeks after AI to maximize their submission rate and the likelihood that they will maintain their pregnancy. To identify the non-cycling cows, pre-breeding heat detection should begin one month before breeding, otherwise do a pre-breeding ultrasound scan. And cows that are not cycling and are at least 30 days after calving, put them on a synchronization protocol so that they can be submitted at mating start date for AI. Now the cows that have, are not yet uh, 30 days calved, they should be put in a synchronization protocol once they pass the 30 day, um, day mark um, and so that they can be submitted for AI by day 21 of the breeding season. The next step is to metric check the entire herd to identify the cows with a uterine disease. Now we know that uh, approximately 20% of the herd will have a uterine disease four weeks before mating start date. Now while, while these cows might eventually recover without treatment, we do know that earlier treatment will improve conception rates. So these animals should be treated with an intrauterine antibiotic. Then once the breeding season commences, submission rates should be monitored weekly to make sure the targets are being met. Keep uh, daily uh, AI records either manually or through the electronic handheld. And if you are not submitting 30% of your herd by week one, 60% of your herd by week two, or 90% of your herd by week three, then you need to identify the animals that have not been submitted, get them checked out and take action so that they can be submitted for AI as soon as possible. Now we also know that there are going to be some problem cows in the herd that may need some additional action. Uh, to get uh, submitted during the first three weeks of the breeding season. So these are cows that have had calving issues or have had health issues during the spring. These are cows with a, a low fertility sub-index or the late calvers, so the cows that calved in late March, uh, April or even uh, May. So it's important for you to identify these cows and to know that there are solutions to improve their chances of getting a calf during the early weeks of the breeding season.